Our topic for today is all about divisibility rule for 11. Divisibility rule for 11. If the difference of the sum of the digits in the odd places and the sum of those in the even places is zero or divisible by 11. For example, 583. In the odd places, 5 and 3. Get the sum, 5 plus 3 equals 8. And the even place is 8. Then get the difference of their sum, 8 minus 8 equals 0. Since the difference is 0, therefore, 583 is divisible by 11. Another example, 35,794. The digits in the odd places are 3, 7, and 4. Get the sum, 3 plus 7 plus 4 equals 14. Then, the digits in the even places are 5 and 9. Get the sum 5 plus 9 equals 14. Then get the difference 14 minus 14 equals 0. Therefore, 35,794 is divisible by 11. Another example, 623,000 381. The digits in the odd places are 6, 3, and 8. Get the sum. 6 plus 3 plus 8 equals 17. The digits in even places are 2 and 3 and 1. Get the sum. 2 plus 3 plus 1 equals 6. Get the difference of their sum, 17 minus 6 equals 11. Therefore, 623,381 is divisible by 11. Another example, 235,983. The digits in the odd places are 2, 5, and 8. Get the sum. 2 plus 5 plus 8 equals 15. The digits in even places are 3, 9, and 3. Get the sum. 3 plus 9 plus 3 equals 15. Then 15 minus 15 equals 0. Therefore, 235,983 is divisible by 11. Another example, 641,256. The digits in odd places are 6, 1, and 5. Get the sum, 6, plus 1, plus 5, equals 12. The digits in even places are 4, 2, and 6. Get the sum, 4, plus 2, plus 6, equals 12. Then, subtract 12, minus 12, equals 0. Therefore, 641,256 is divisible by 11. Another example, 10,846. The digits in odd places are 1, 8, and 6. Get the sum, 1 plus 8 plus 6 equals 15. 
The digits in even places are 0 and 4. Get the sum, 0 plus 4 equals 4. Then, get the difference, 15 minus 4 equals 11. Therefore, 10,846 is divisible by 11. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.